everyone welcome back to another minecraft video and yeah in today's video well uh i'm going to be showing you guys 10 weird things in minecraft because we love weird things yep we do so i need for the first thing is you need an anvil because anvils are kind of cool and then you need a name tag and then you need some mobs so maybe you can have a pig uh, I don't know, maybe you could want a cow. Uh, maybe you could want a... I don't know what else you could want. I don't know, maybe, uh... Well, let's say chicken. Yep, we love chickens. So basically what you do is you put down your anvil. You go in with a name tag, right? And then you name it Dinner Bone. I don't know why, I don't, I don't know why it's called Dinner Bone because it's anything else. But it's Dinner Bone. So basically, when you basically spawn a pig, you know, let's do this. Um, I think I. S you see, guys, you see the mistake there was that dinner bun, that bun, but the lower case it's like this. And now, yeah, yeah. Now if you do it, it's backwards. I don't know why it's just backwards. Like, look at it. It's back. It's a backwards pig. Like, if you have a chicken and you name it, it's, it's backwards. Like, why? I don't know why. Like, what? The cows too. You do this with any single mob in the game. You can do this with any single mob in the game. I don't know why. That's a function. But yeah, it's pretty. It's a pretty cool thing, you know. You can just have like a whole bunch of pigs, you know. Just like do this, and then you name all the dinner bones. Your dinner bone, 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 dinner bones. Because they're all dinner bones. Yeah, they can get pretty funny, you know. It's like cursed Minecraft, but it's not cursed. This is actual Minecraft. And, which is the weird thing about it, but yeah, it works like that. Um, Alright, so yeah, now that we're done with that, I guess we get on to our... Well, I guess we get on to our second thing, you know. Something most people don't know, it has to do with the 1.16 update. So if you have... Hold on, let me get some black. So yeah, if you go get some... Uh, if you just, you know, if you, you know, if you go nether, hunt, if you go nether, you know, you, you go to the nether, you know, maybe you need to, like, um, I don't know what you want to do with the nether, but maybe you want to do something with it. You know, you go mining, right? You go mining. So, yeah, basically, uh, if you get a craft, maybe you get yourself a crafting table. Uh, it can, you, you, it has all the, Paxton has all the properties of, let's say, Darn it, bro. Hold up. Let me just get nine more pieces. Uh, black sand. And... Yeah, uh, if you have blackstone, right? And you just do this, it can create furnaces. So it's basically... So blackstone's basically stone in the nether. Like, it's a pretty cool thing. However, it doesn't really serve a purpose. Uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of useless. So yeah, uh, let's get on with our third thing. Three on the list. It's, it's an even weirder one. I'll tell you guys that. So, yeah, uh, um, basically, you know, you look to the menu, you just not, you know, you, you don't really care about many, much, most of it, you know, but for but something you, you need to remember, guys, uh, you, this is that has to do with the end. So the port. So yeah, uh, you guys have to. You guys know that this is an end portal, right? It looks like an end portal, and then yeah, uh, exactly, you get an end portal, right? But yeah, but then if you break it, yeah, it, it's it's a bit glitchy. Um, I'm, I'm not sure why it's like that, but yeah, that's something you can think about. Glitchy end portals. You know, that's that's really kind of cool. Uh, Alright, so next up, you have something weirder. 
it's 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 more of like a it was more of something you know that that that's kind of good I guess. Um. Oh, I want to put it. So yeah, uh, if we go into our creative setting, and then we go into uh, transportation. You know, you guys can see the minecart with furnace. Now, most people don't know what to actually do with those because who knows what to do with those? Like those, those are some. Those are like really weird. So yeah, I'm gonna show you. No, 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 not yet, not yet. All right, let's let's break that so it can't actually go over. And then what we do here is we have another one. We can we'll connect it later. We have the minecart with the furnace. Now what you gotta do is you have to get some coal. And then let's say we want to put something in the, in in the minecart. For example, we want to put probably a villager because that's what most people do. You try to, okay, that that was an accident. Ah. Uh, villager, uh, and then you try to get him in. Uh, right, let's get a second. Uh, no, bad villager. Uh, Alright, yeah, see, look. Now we have uh, two villagers that are in the minecart. Uh, so now what we do, uh, maybe, you know, maybe we uh, make this a bit harder for them. Uh, oh, no. Alright, this is, this is good. Uh, bad, real fast. Uh, so, uh,. You know, maybe what we do is we do this, do this, do this. There's no way for them to actually go up. Because, but, I want to just clear that. Right? Okay, darn it. Well, let me get my coal back again. So yeah, uh, basically what you do is you... Yeah, if, is if you keep putting coal in there, you can get it moving. Yeah, see, look, you can get it moving. Yeah, see, look, they're gone now. It's really cool. So yeah, it, the, fur, the the thing with the, the minecart with the furnace, it's basically just a way for you for to it's like it's like basically an engine. And look, they're all over here. And then and then we punch the villagers. We punch this guy for the Um yeah, he's he's angry at me. Yeah, but now oh yeah, that's, that means slash game mode that can be creative because yeah that's 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 cool um so yeah basically if we go to creative now all right yeah so now basically if we go just somewhere that is really far away from the village uh we can actually we, we we're gonna go now and create our own iron golem so in order to do that if you guys don't know already you gotta get some blocks of iron you have to get a jack-o-lantern Wait, I think it's a card pumpkin, but we, we'll see if this works. I'm not sure. We place it in this pattern. Exactly. You get an, you get an iron golem. But if you hit you, but if you hit him, he actually stays loyal to you. So yeah, uh, that's something to uh, uh, noteworthy. But that that's actually a, that's that's a way to tell. Um, you know, it's not exactly that useful because iron golems are just annoying like the re recreation of it it's basically ups you basically what you'll see there is obsidian you'll you'll see some lava uh, I, I think they're called like a broken uh, I think it's called like a broken portal I'm not entirely sure so yeah uh, you'll probably see some magma blocks but yeah, uh, basically what you see is something like this, you know, this is something like that, and like that. Yeah, and then you'll see some netherrack just there. Yeah, you know, and then you'll see some lava. There. You know, you see lava here. You know, oh god, netherrack, netherrack, netherrack. I don't, I don't see the point of this, but I guess. I guess. Kinda cool. And basically you'll see something like this, you know? In this kind of building style. It's automatic world generated, so it's not the most beautiful thing in the world. Yeah, but it's something like this. And then uh off to the side somewhere you'll see a portal. Uh and, you know. 
something like this. And then you'll see another portal. It's, it's the most standard kind. There's nothing really to it. Oh my god. Yeah, break those. And then you get a flint and steel. Uh, and yeah, you can light it, up, light it up. But what some of you guys don't know is that... Uh, oh, we got I can't be bothered with the nether. Yeah, well, we're gonna go back to the overworld. This nether's just not interesting. And, alright, let's just go back. Oh, yeah, uh, there's a thing. Hold up. It's loading. Um, alright, yeah, so that's, that's the, that's another portal thing for you. So, uh, next up on the list, it also has to do with nether stuff. So basically, if you have a water bucket, right? Look, you know how like the, the nether portals sometimes make these weird, creepy noises? No one likes them. Everyone wish they could be deleted from the game. Probably just me, but you know. No one, I don't like it. So what you do, right? If you have a water bucket, you place it there. It, yeah, it, it actually, it actually uh, breaks the nether portal. So yeah, that is actually how you can uh, make 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 it weird, you know. And then you can just have it light up with a flint and steel dispenser or something. So yeah. Uh, speaking of Nether portals, our next item on the list also has to do with Nether portals, but this one's a bit hard. So basically, you did it two blocks deep, right? And then let's say you don't have a flint and steel for whatever reason. Um, don't ask me why you don't have another portal. Yeah, basically, if you have lava here, right? And then you may maybe get some oak planks, because, you, know, you know, some oak planks. And then you do this. And then you wait for it to catch on fire. You can make that a bit easier. Hold up, come on, catch on fire. It's not that hard. How is this thing not catching on fire? Uh, catch on fire, please. Uh... Please, game, can you have it catch on fire? Wow, did these... Oh yeah, see, like, the oak planks, that oak plank just caught on fire. Uh, basically, you need, you need both of these to catch on fire. It takes some time, and it doesn't kind of work, doesn't really work. Um, yeah. Item on the list is well, it's not exactly like really good. Uh, uh, most people don't know why. Uh, you can't. There's just just many people know there's something. If you have like soul sand, you know, uh, soul sand, and then you want to make a bubble elevator, you just go up and stuff, you know, and then you make it. Right? It's not that hard. But for some reason, but many of you guys are probably wondering this as well. So yeah, I'm gonna tell you guys. If you guys have a water bucket, right, and you want to create that soul sand thing, it's not working, and you're like, why in the world not? It's it's because all of these blocks there is a you know, water source block. So yeah, there's one, two, three blocks. As you guys can see here, there's uh, three blocks. Uh, so yeah, you need to place three water buckets in there to kind of as to make sure it's a water source block. Uh, if you if I just get a bucket, I can show you guys what it looks like. Yeah, uh, if you have a bucket, right? And we just empty it all out. And all right, we go here, right? And it, you go to F3 and look at it, and it says. Falling wa Minecraft water is just falling, so that means that's how you know uh, that 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 it's it's not good. So yeah, what I usually do is you go from the bottom and you go up layer by layer for it to work. Yeah, see, like you'll know it works when there's uh, those bubbles. All right. Oh yeah, that was it, guys. So. Thank you guys for watching this episode of Minecraft.
and we'll see you in the next one. Uh, subscribe, like,